Hey guys, so just a quick tidbit before the vlog starts. I just wanted to let you guys know of a super, super exciting event that is happening. The whole month of October, there will be something going on online, which is called the Vegan World Summit. Now, what this is, is a month-long event of live Q&A sessions every single day from 25 vegan YouTubers. And there's going to be people a part of it from... Ravana, Raw Lyman, Ted Carr, Evan Rock, Plantriotic, Tim Sheaf, and many, many more people. And I'm also going to be speaking and giving talks once every week. Basically, um, each YouTuber will be giving one talk per week and on any topic of their choice. For me, I will be talking about raw food versus cooked food, female physique, um, being vegan in a non-vegan world and becoming the future of veganism the best form of activism So those are my four topics and every other youtuber will have each of their own four topics And they'll be giving one talk per week and then having an hour-long Live Q&A session where you guys can join in watch comment and it's basically just like a live hangout session with all of your favorite youtubers for a whole month which is really really cool you guys can get your tickets for the event at www.veganworldsummit.com and you guys can also get twenty dollars off your entry fee if you use the coupon code maddie for vegan so use that coupon code and go check it out I'll leave all the links to everything you need to know in the description down below and enjoy the video. Oh, good morning guys. I'm out just for one last quick spin here in Bali. We leave for Australia tonight which is really exciting but we've got a lot of packing and we gotta pack up our bikes. So I'm just out for a quick spin, doing some steep hills. I actually, the hills are so steep that I had to uh, take a break. And me being really freaking dumb, I stopped in the middle of the hill and then tried to keep going up the hill and it was just way too steep and I freaking fell over. Yeah, so I got a little scrape, <laughs> but you know, and yeah, just cruising around, doing some steep hills. All right, so I'm back from my very short ride. We're gonna go spend some time at the beach because it's our last day and I'm really gonna miss the beach. So I think we're gonna go to one of the like more private beaches that we found. I'm not sure if I showed you guys yet or not. I don't think I did. So yeah, we're gonna go there and then we might go to another beach depending on the time because we haven't packed the bikes up or anything. We haven't packed anything. That's what we're doing, we're going to the beach. So I've been with you guys here. Whoa, oh, big iguana. There he is. Oh. Sorry, babe. The tide, too high and there's no beach today. So scratch that. Decided to come to Dreamland Beach for our last beach trip. I think this beach is probably the nicest beach for swimming. my camera in the sand, which was kind of a fiasco. Yeah. Sorry. It's all good. There's like one little grain of sand like in the lens. 
I don't know. But everything else is fine, so that's okay. So, I have got to shower, and then we've got to pack everything up again. So a few people have said that we are part of the gang that is living on permanent vacation. So, I was thinking about it while I was on the beach, and I'm like looking around, and there's so many people, like everyone who is there, is there for vacation. Vacation is something that you do to get away from your regular life for like a week or three weeks and then you go back to regular life. That's what a vacation is. And apparently we're living on permanent vacation when in reality it's not a vacation, it's just the life that we're choosing to live. And I've only been traveling for three months. I don't really understand how that's permanent. For all these people that are saying us vegan YouTubers are living on permanent vacation. I think they're still stuck in the mindset that you need to work, you need to be a part of the system where you don't need to. And we're living examples of that. We're just living our lives. And it may seem like, like a vacation, but it's not really. We're still doing work behind the scenes and the destinations that we choose to live is up to us because we have that freedom. Just wanted to dress that. You dropped my camera in the sand, asshole. I didn't drop it, it fell off the gorilla pot. All right, so we have started packing. All of our shit is everywhere, but we've started. have packed up the bike boxes and our bags are pretty much packed we just have to pack the last minute things and we also had a quick nap because we knew that we probably wouldn't be sleeping very much tonight and we land early in the morning in Australia so yeah we had a quick nap and right now got some potatoes whoa over boiling in here Got some potatoes boiling in the rice cooker. So we're gonna have some potatoes and then eat as much of this white rice as we can. Got our bellies all nice and full before we fly. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Quick dinner before we head out. Got some potatoes and some rice. I got some coconut sugar on there right now. And I'm gonna eat this and then we're off to the airport. We are in our comfy flight apparel and it feels really friggin weird. I'm wearing socks right now <laughs> and I haven't worn socks for like two months and it feels really weird. Kyle's all decked out like it's friggin winter. It's cold now, Luke. Like. <laughs> Bus has arrived. Oh, I'm zoomed in. These are the faces of tired ass people. Thank you. 
some items may have moved. Please know that smoking is not permitted on this aircraft, including inside the lavatories. Let us know at Nobody any time if you need any assistance. Hard. Thank you. We're on the plane now. It is almost midnight. I'm gonna try and get some sleep. I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow when we land. See you guys tomorrow.